to get things started, it's an exchange between Zenit Kazan and Trentino Diatek. And the Russians' Viktor Politaev does well to keep the ball in play. They follow it up with a fantastic double block to stay alive. But in the end, Trentino's Mitar Turic is just a little too much to handle. An excellent serve by Alessandro Fey causes Trentino Diatek problems, but Mitar Turic manages to save the ball at the barrier. The Kuchina Lube Civitanova opposite then tries again from open play, but is denied once more. What an absolutely monstrous block by Oleg Antonov. Wilfredo Leon is stopped in his tracks by Thomas Jeschke, after which Zenit Kazan's libero Alexei Verbov shows us exactly what he's made of. His fantastic reactions keep the ball alive, and then Mikhailov shows his gratitude and draws a line under this rally. This rally looks like it's over quickly when Alessandro Fey fires a bullet Zhezhov's way, but then Russell Holmes does a great job to stop the Kuchina Lube Civitanova player's attack. The momentum then shifts, and this time it's the Italian team and Mika Christensen who keeps the ball in play with an acrobatic retrieval, and his hard work pays off as Pretty secures the point. Maxim Mikhailov gets a little lucky and manages to cover his own attack while using his head at an important time in the game to kick off this amazing rally. Then Wilfredo Leon shows off his skills, but this time in defense, and the exchange continues. The Cuban high flyer then does what we are more used to seeing and ends the rally with a vicious pipe attack.